Hey there guys, uh, what's up? Um, welcome to this tutorial. Um, so today I'll be showing you how to basically uh, import uh, your video into Sony Vegas that you have recorded from Bandicam. Or it could be some other, you know, uh, AVI file. Now the problem with this is basically, uh, I'll, show you, I'll show it to you. Give me a sec. Um, Go to my documents, Bandicam, yeah. So I've got this video of NFS that I actually am uploading right, like right now. Whoopsie Daisy, like right now here. Um, uh, yeah. So I'll be showing you how to basically, uh, you know, make it work. Now, see if I drag, what the hell? Yeah. So the problem is if I drag, a, drag a, an AVI, God freaking damn it! What the hell, man? All right, sorry. Uh, <laughs> that was a fail, but you never mind. Yeah, so if I drag an AVI file or a file that I've just used, to, uh, a file that I've recorded from Bandicam, what actually happens is that the video remains. Um, as you guys can see, the video is like right here. Uh, but, but, well, right over here, you can see the audio that's an MTP. Uh, you know, it's just empty without any audio. Now to get the gaming audio or whatever audio it is, uh, what you need to do is you need to get this one, um, you know, uh, one uh, software called Virtual Dub. All right, I'll put the link in the description. Just go ahead and download it. It's now you. This may seem to be rocket science or whatever it is, but trust me, it's not. Uh, now what you need to do, what you need to do is basically just extract it onto a desktop or copy it into a folder. And you can it'll be like this, like how I these will be the it'll be in a raw file with these full files. Just copy them into a, you know, into a file, and just go ahead and open it. So this is how it looks. All right. Now there's nothing to be frightened about. Don't quit the video thinking that this is crazy. And uh, yeah, before you go, this does not reduce the video quality. Get that straight. It keeps the exact same video quality right so there's nothing to worry about all right copy the clip just go ahead and drag it otherwise click file open video file and do it i've got my two things here i don't know which is which so i'm just going to go ahead and drag this one into it just drag it and this message will show up avi stream just ignore that it's all right so now as you guys can see the video is like right here uh it's a little small big it's a little you know cut out because of the size of my screen Nevertheless, if you have a big screen, the full thing will be shown. All right, first things first, you need to go to audio, and you need to make sure you click. Oh, uh, you need to click a uh, full processing mode. All right, now once you click, once again, go to audio, full processing mode. It'll be in direct, but make it full processing mode. Then go to video, all right, and click direct stream copy. All right, now again, I'm going to repeat this last time. As soon as you open it, import the video, go to audio and make sure it's on full processing mode. And once you're done with that, go to video and make sure it's on direct stream copy. And next you can go ahead and save it for that. Go to file, save as, oh shit, sorry. I went and clicked the wrong one. Go to file, save as AVI, choose your location, and save it. Now, as you guys can see, I already have it. So I'm not gonna do it. 348, yes, that's the one. So. All right, now I gotta find that. NFS got freaking help. Yeah, this is it. All right, this is the video. As you guys can see, it's 1.71 GB, and uh, the actual one that I recorded is uh, it's only 1.60. So as you guys can see, there's no deterioration in the blah, 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 in the video quality. So it's pretty good. So I'm gonna drag this right now. Why do I keep pressing the right mouse button? It's a small mouse, so I keep you know screwing up. So now, as you guys can see. There is audio. I'll play it. Alright, so that that that's that's the tutorial for you guys I had today. I hope you I hope this helped you. If it did, do leave a big thumbs up. It really helps me out. And I'll see you next video. See you. Take care. Ta-ta!